What's going on, everybody? It's your main man, Destroyers, here. And today we're back on some Forza once again. Uh, let me do another episode of Can I Even Drift. Today we're using this lovely Lexus LFA, and I think we're going to take it on Silverstone National. Uh, I haven't. I don't think I've done this on the series yet. You know, it's probably the main track that we all that you know me, Slap, Diligence, everybody. We always slide online together. So, you know. See how I can do by myself. You know, sometimes when I'm sliding with them, I'll screw up. My lines are bad. That that turn right there that, that you see that that big sweeper towards the end of it. For some reason, I tend to I tend to go off the track at, at the end, and I'm not too sure why. I think it, I think it just has something to do with my counter steer, but we'll see if I can't fix that today. Gotta get used to Forza. I've been playing so much R Factor lately. Alright, let's line up over here. Good launch. That was an awesome launch. Yes, I am using braking line. A lot of you guys are going to hate on it. But whatever. Screw you. Don't care. Everyone has their own opinion. Oh, oh, come on. It's one, see, th that's just one turn that I've been having trouble being, you know, keeping a smooth line on it. I'm not too sure why. You know. I think I get so so focused on trying to to hold a, a good line that I don't actually oh shit that I don't actually focus on keeping a smooth line. You know what I mean, whether it's inside, outside, whatever. Half the time, you know, it's just I'm jumping around the freaking tr oh, oh, oh. Okay, let's uh, calm down, calm. The fuck down. Holy shit. Man, I love the way this freaking thing sounds. That wasn't that bad. That was actually pretty good. Now comes the hard part for me. No, see, you're trying to go outside again. Stop it. All right, here we go. I think for the next, can I even drift? I'm gonna try Bathurst. It's crazy as that sounds. You know, it's a quick back and forth section. You know, the, the downhill, whatever you want to call it. I don't know the actual technical name for that section. I'm sure there is a name. Oh, son of a bitch. But I feel feel that in that section I'll actually be able to somewhat whip the wheel. You know what I mean? So. We'll see. I just want to listen to this thing real quick. Oops. Dude, this thing's really quiet in the car. Oh. Sounds amazing. Damn so. Oh, there you go. Screwing up the big turn again. But I feel like I've I found like the generalized area. I guess you can see where I gotta hold the wheel for that turn. And I, you know, that's one thing I've done done for a lot of a lot of turns in this game is you know try to remember 
what the wheel looks like at a certain angle, you know, just using my peripheral vision or whatever the hell you want to call it. I noticed that, you know, using, using this bottom flat piece of the wheel actually helps a lot. Damn it. So much grip in this game. I think after the battery section video that I do. Uh, oh, there's that burp. Yeah, everyone was saying, where's the burp in the R Factor video? Well, there it is on Forza. Maybe Forza just makes me sick. Who knows? Um, but after the batteries video, I think I might try and do a build video. Well, I'll probably do it on like some stock tires or street tires. Maybe try like a street car, you know what I mean? Full stiff suspension, barely 300 horsepower. We'll see what happens. That run was uh, just completely useless. There we go. Good one. Come on. Okay, not bad. Not bad. Ah. Whatever. Whatever. Alright. Okay, that wasn't that bad. Kind of had to let off at the end, though. It's pretty slow exit speed. Not bad, though. Improving, improving. One thing I have noticed while sliding with someone, it is kind of... It almost feels easier on the wheel because you, you can judge speed a lot easier and your angle. So you see what someone else is getting and try to match it, not try to go too far past it. Come on. Gotta change the gearing on this car. Need to either make second a little bit longer or third a little bit shorter. Oh, no high speed. Not yet. Not yet. Try high speed after like another run or two. Going super wide, using all the track. Yeah, these gears need to be fixed badly. And it's nice, but I would prefer them to be a little bit longer once I'm not banging off rev. I'm actually using what traction I have while sideways. This is being in rev way too much. Alright, I think it's high speed time. We'll count that as two runs. One down, one back. got this. We got this. We're doing this. Oh, no, no. Nope. I don't like it. Don't like it. Nope. Going back. It was looking super nice until the car went straight. Cones, get all the cones, kill the cones.
Here we go. Here we go. We got, we got it this time. Hey, now. Okay, that could have been a lot better. But I'm going to take it. Now can we finish it up with a nice run? No, stop it! You bitch! No! No! You! <clears throat> Alright, you know what? I'm just going to haul ass around the track and go from there. Just yeah, mm -hmm, you know, daily daily driving circuit driver. <laughs> Kinda mad. I messed that up literally at the end. I feel that this is gonna be the one. Holy shit! Wait, wait, wait. There's more films. Die. Alright, here we go. Come on, LFA, don't let me down. One more try, guys. I promise. One more try. I'm, I'm gonna get this. I don't care. It's gonna happen. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Coming a lot more inside. Straight. No. Whatever. Now we're just gonna go for the flip, and if it doesn't flip, I'm sorry, but it's still the end of the video. All right, no flip. All right, guys. Well, I appreciate you guys coming out, watching me. You know, slowly, slowly getting better at this. But it is happening. Uh, but yeah, once again, thank you guys for coming out. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. It's your main man, Destroyers. I'm out. See ya.